Welcome to Zade Blades Escapades. I am Zade Blades, your host, and today is Saturday, so yes, there is another mod preview. And the preview I have for you today um, is a version 0.4 of the Better Minecraft mod. Okay, this is not released yet, this is pre release, so you cannot even download this. This is a peek into where we will be um, once version 0.4 comes out. Now last time we had mentioned about the Minotaurs and the Minotaur Kings and how we're going to be having a special labyrinth for them. So I want to show you what I've been working on. Right here. This is the entrance or will be the entrance to the labyrinth with the Minotaur Kings. Um, as you can see I took some inspiration from the Minotaur head. Um, uh, I used stone brick uh, for the head and let's see what else um, yes yeah, so there's stone brick here so it'll be a source of stone brick if you find it I've also have the new version of the um, sandstone this is smooth sandstone for the horns sort of to give it another texture and then for the eyes I was originally going with um, with red wool with lights on the inside um, and then I got the idea to just use uh, netherrack and fire. It gives a really cool effect, um, especially at nighttime, to have these burning eyes. So in the game, once version um, one version once version 0 0.4 comes out, you will find these within the world, and they will randomly spawn. Um, I will have them randomly spawn in forest biomes, but currently they randomly spawn anywhere. So. <laughs> and a lot of them. As you can see, there are quite a few um, that I have generated. Now, you might be asking, why are there so many? Um, the main reason is so that I can find them easily. Um, if I make it hard to find, then I spend all my time, instead of modding, I spend all my time trying to find the stupid thing. So, uh, instead of trying to find it, I just spawn a lot of them. Or generate a lot of them. Now, another way to find them is to look for the burning forest because the eyes are on fire and they tend to light the trees on fire if there are trees above them. So that is something to um, be aware of. Now, currently there's nothing below them. As you can see, it is just... Well, that one's not even finished. That's odd. Um, let's see, is this one finished? Yeah, this one's finished. Hmm glitched one. Don't worry, I'm going to work all the tweaks out of this. Um, what's going to happen is you're going to come to this little guy here. There's actually going to be a hole. You plop in the hole and clear this out. And you're going to come in here and what this is going to be is a stairwell going to be a stairwell all the way down eight it's going to be a stairwell that goes 18 down um, so you're going to have 18 blocks down so it could I think it could kill you if you jumped off of it but we'll see um, so you just got to be careful but yeah it'll be 18 blocks down and then this will lead to the labyrinth. So this will be, again, stone brick all through here. Um, and it'll lead all the way down with stone brick steps. Kind of parkour sort of steps where you have to jump up and jump down to get to each one. Um, yeah, so my next step is creating the stairwell and the labyrinth um, where these new minotaur, uh, minotaurs and the minotaur, minotaur kings will be. So, yeah. I hope you enjoyed, and this is just a short one to show you where I'm at. It took a little while to figure this out, but it's with random with randomly generated buildings. Once you've uh, worked with them for a little bit, they're quite easy. Like it took me a while to get the base down, but once I got the base down, you it's quite easy to code the rest of it. So anyway, um, this is Zade Blade signing off, and I will see you guys in another hopefully, 
uh, week for another mod preview of the Better Minecraft mod. And hopefully by then, I should have the labyrinth done with the stairwell down and generate the um, Minotaur King and the Minotaurs inside. So I'll see you then. Cheers.